Let's just arrange to meet at the restaurant later, all right? All right. Well, what time? Wait a minute. Why am I getting the bums rush here? Oh, it's not that at all. It's just that Mason and I have some things to talk about, legal matters, and we don't have much time. Okay, well, but if you're going to tell me a lie that you know I know is a lie, that I can deal with. Good. Thank you. Goodbye. How about in a couple of hours? Great. That, that's great. Good. Perfect. I'll see you then. Right. Okay. Strange. Very strange. Well, what was it? A stray cat that got into the garage somehow and knocked some things off a shelf. What about Sasha? Did you check? Well, she didn't magically transform herself into a stray cat, darling. She's still there. Right now, I'm more worried about Augusta. She's more curious than any cat. Oh, God. Oh, God. I'm a wreck. I'm a wreck. She noticed. I'm a wreck. She noticed. I feel like I'm covering up for a crime that I actually committed. I'm a wreck. I'm a wreck. I'm a wreck. Julia, get a grip. We haven't done anything wrong. We are the Crusaders for Justice here. As a matter of fact, we're going to become Sasha's Avenger and find out who actually killed her. Fine. We don't even know where to start. I mean, we can't just walk around town with a dead woman in our freezer. I mean, what if Augusta wants pork chops for breakfast? What are you doing? Voila. We are going to padlock the freezer. We will be the only ones with the keys, so no one can get in. That will buy us some time. You mean we're just going to keep her in the freezer indefinitely? Like some ugly wedding well, present? No, no, not indefinitely. Julia, Julia, think of it this way. Sasha would have wanted it like this. Her youth and her beauty were the two things she prized most, and if we can preserve them Don't for her... Don't even then... finish it! Storing a dead woman in a freezer with head trimmers can hardly be construed as an act of mercy. You act as if we can just pick up the jumper cables and start her up at any time. We can't. You know, I've been thinking about Sasha's days with Tanel. Maybe one of his people got to her for some purpose of his own. All right. All right. This is what we'll do. Go to the Orient Express. We'll talk to Augusta about Sasha. We'll get her to tell us if Sasha has any more enemies. Oh, my God. God, why did I promise her that I would have dinner with her? Well, you're going to have to go alone, darling. I've got to put the padlock on the freezer. Well, how long will that take? Well, I don't know. I'm not a carpenter. Um, an hour or so, but it's the first priority. I don't know how much more of this I can take. I hated her. I really did. But at this moment, I don't know which one of us is worse off. <laughs>